come on, Jim, boy. That's a boy. Come on. This bark. Have you died in there? No, I'm coming out. There's not enough light. Take some more outside and then let go. Oh, it's frozen. This place gives me the creeps. You mean to tell me those kids lived in there for over six months? Well, after that old battle axe at the Dower House, it must have seemed like paradise. Well, how do they keep warm and cook? You can't have a fire in a tree. Oh, hold it! Oh. Uh, uh, oh. So now you know. Photograph, Jack. Dragging their ankles before the day's out. fresh. Can't be far ahead now. It's going to be a storm. Gosh, I hope so. A real blizzard. We might get snowed in at Smoko's. Well, at least no one will come and bother us if we are. I'm glad we're in the hut now and not that old tree. Look, I think we ought to split up. You follow the trap lines and I'll go to the deadfall. It'll be quicker that way. What's the matter? I heard something. Like a horse neighing. Come on. She's going the right way. I thought the car was in the opposite direction. Shut up and come on. I should have bought a gun. I don't fancy that damn grey bear coming up on me from behind. They spent days searching the forest. He's obviously not in the chase any longer. Well, they never did find him, did they? I bet he's ravenous by now. Oh, I need a drink. You need a gag. <coughs> well, now, what have we here? Take a picture, Jack. Of a dirty saucepan? Don't be ridiculous. We're taking this back with us. It could be anyone's picnic party or porch or something. It could be, but I bet it's come from the Dower House kitchen. Come on. Hey, wait for 
me! It's much more comfortable living with a smoker. Hey, look! It's a fox. I thought it was a badger. I'm really quite glad it wasn't. It'll make a lovely muff. Who for? Aunt Ellen won't want an old fox skin. She's got a sable muff. I'll get Smoko to cure it. He'll make a much better job than me. Robin will try and bag the skin for himself. Well, he can't have it. It's my turn. Travis, the fox is mine. That's forest law. All right, keep your wig on. Anyway, I've decided to give it to Angela Bowers. Oh, mushy. She helped you escape in Brendan, and she came to warn us about the search party. How are you going to give it to her? I'll find a way. You'd always pass it up and ask Smoko to give it to her. Oh, no. Now, I say the oak tree was about here, okay? You would take a mile or two? I'd say that were about right, miss. According to Sergeant Bunting, that is. He reckons it's just about dead centre. And we found the saucepan about here. Right, Jack? About half a mile due east of the oak. Ernie, which way has the search party been going? They've been beating the woods from west to east, so they've come on the tree from this direction. So the boys heard the beaters coming and beat a hasty retreat to the east. Now, assuming they dropped the saucepan here... Big assumption. Assuming they did, we should be able to continue this line to find out exactly where they were going. Unless, of course, they were intending to go straight out of the forest on this side, they must have been heading for somewhere specific. What's that mark there? Well, I'll be damned. What is it? It's the charcoal kilns. Smoko Joe, of course. He's hiding them. No wonder they just vanished. I'm not moving out of that door until the rain stops. I'm warning, Mr. Rumble. Sure. Well enough for you, is it? Ah, uh, how sharp. What'd that be? You sure, Ernie. You sure telephone. I help yourself. Cherry Walden, 1 6. I gave you a please, Mrs. Baines. Doctor. Hello, uh, Miss Alcorn. It's Mr. Rumbold here. Uh, no, no, Miss, I, I've never reached the station. You best get Miss Ansman to send a taxi to fetch the Colonel. Uh, no. Too wet for the trap, Miss. Colonel be apt round before I got him back to the Dower House. No, Miss, I'll stay here till the storm passes. And then I'll bring the trap back. Uh, yeah. Very well, miss. Goodbye. They're not hurry, are they?
This dang weather ain't no good for man or beast. This is stupid. We're soaked already. I might just as well go back to Smoko's. No one's going to be searching for the bear in weather like this. You're not supposed to walk under trees when there's lightning. Oh, shut up and come on. 